Well, isn't it? Isn't it just a beautiful, beautiful morning, night? I mean, about to be morning. Welcome back, fems and dems and dudettes. We're 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 back, and I'm gonna pass another hour of time uh, just to get the day started. It is cold, even with day passing. Eh, it's cold, but I'm not freezing or anything. Uh, give me something to drink because I'm currently dehydrated and I didn't pay attention. And yeah, that's that's entirely my fault. Um, ooh, we're out of water, so getting water um, is going to be one of my main priorities, I guess. Food. Wait, I sound like I have so much stuff with me, but I shouldn't. Like, I should not be... I guess I have a bunch of, like, like doodads on me, so I'm just going to drop some stuff on the ground. Doop and doop. And I don't think I need the shell casings anytime soon. What about the quality tools? I'll leave that stuff here because we're going to turn this into our base of operation. Drop, please. Uh, the various gallons of liquid. We don't need to carry those around. And I think this looks like a good amount of stuff. 26 uh, pounds, that's not a lot. So that's good. I'm going to go ahead and drop the antibiotics. Because I don't need those with me either. Um, I, I, at least not all of them. That's that's the point. Should I repair anything that I'm wearing right now? Um, I don't think that's necessary. I mean, those wool long johns would probably be a good thing to repair. So how about we do that? Um, oh, I need cloth, for which I would have to rip some stuff apart, and that would cost more time. Tell you what, we're gonna do that. I still want to repair that one thing uh, before I go out, and, you know, we want to, I guess, the day to warm up a little bit. I don't know if it does. Let's have a quick look, shall we? Let's go outside, see what the temperature is. We're gonna do something, and then we're going to... Where would that be? Uh, feels like minus 15, but it's minus 31 and minus 13 wind chill. Okay, that's fairly easy to remember. 31 and 13. So, let's rip something apart. Like the worn wool shirt. Eh, what's something I have, like, too much of? Decent cotton toque is a thing, and the wool scarf. Yeah, we can rip those apart. No problem. Um, I could also just get curtains, I guess, but... I might as well do it uh, in here. It's just 10 minutes. And I don't know if you can hear, but we have like a rooster uh, in our house now, and he's crowing. So that's that's a thing you might hear or not. I can hear him through my uh, headphones. It must be something particularly important that he tries to tell us. Okay, um, let's harvest this one as well. I do hope that I get to... Um, get the badge, or at least um, far enough in this game before it's over, because that would be a shame if I, like, I'm at 22 days or something, and then the event's over and I can't get the badge anymore. That'd be unfortunate. Okay, he, he's coming closer to the door. He keeps screaming. All right, repair, please. Shouldn't take too long. 45 minutes. So, nope, oh, that failed. So much for that. It shouldn't be too difficult, except when it is. Okay. That's at 79% now. That's decent. Okay. We're very well packed up. Should I bring a bedroll? No. No need for that. What about... That's just random stuff lying around. Now that's a little bit lighter, I should have another quick look. Don't want to miss anything important. There's two flares. I'm going to grab those. I don't think I will need them with me, but... um, Better safe than sorry. Let's go and raid some toilets for water. And I'm sure we're going to find some food as well. So I'm not going to bring that along. So let's have a quick look what the temperature says. Uh, temperature says minus 21, minus 1. Okay, so it definitely feels... Uh, so it's definitely warming up. Feels like minus 3, though. So despite our big amount of clothes, we're... Big amount, yes. Despite the masses of clothes that we layered on, we're not doing too hot in terms of temperature. I mean, that's the whole idea about Winter's Embrace. I figure, uh, I guess, aggregating um, wood and such, peanut butter, chips. I guess we're just trying to find a spot where we can hunker down to survive once it gets even colder and colder and colder. Microwave, nope, nothing in there. It's most certainly worth going through the cabinets. Ooh, 
look at that. Stacy got another grape soda, and there's no weasel soda anywhere to be found. And like, even like, look how how nicely drawn it is. Man, I want grape soda now. Oh, man, grape soda sounds great. Ever flame lantern fuel, stale peanut butter. You know what? That's fine. I would still eat stale peanut butter, and wash it. Lit. Wait. Ooh, new condensed milk. Little cow. Moo. Uh, moo. Tomato soup. Man, this is great. Uh, supply of stuff. I'm very happy that we're finding all of those tasty food. Rancid rabbit. I don't know. Uh, I'll take it. Just, oh yeah, now we're, we're smelling weird because we have a uh, rancid rabbit meat. My hope is that I can cook that. And again, should I? Leather shoes, grab those boys. Ski jacket, 51%. Mmm, yes. Candy bar. I see another grape soda on the bed. Are you taunting me, game? <sighs> I keep coming back to this and I always hope for just, just... Just some acknowledgement from Hinterland. It's like, hey, we know that you've been making all of these videos and we put something in there. But, alas, work pants, hey, interesting. I wonder if they're any good. I'm gonna have to do some comparison uh, soon. Ooh, yeah, Summit Soda, always look under the beds. That's where I keep my soda stash. I mean, I don't know where you keep your sodas, but what happens if you wake up in the middle of the night and you're, like, parched and you're thirsty and your, like, throat is dry and your mouth is just, just, like, a desert? Yeah, you don't want to, like, get up and walk to the fridge. No, you want, you want easy, quick, convenient access to the beverage of your choice right underneath your bed. You don't even need to get out. You don't even need to, like, throw the blanket away. I mean, over you. You can just grab it, open it, and enjoy the flavor of grape soda. I should eat something in the game. Also in real life, but mostly in the game right now because I don't like... Here, let's have some ketchup chips. Mm, nom, 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 nom. Wow, look at the temperature just dropping like a rock. You know, people say, like, drop like a rock, but honestly, there's so many things that would drop like a rock. Man, it's difficult to explain something falling quickly without using, like, an example like drop like a rock. I'm, I'm thinking right now, what would be a good alternative? Hmm. Drop like a... Hmm. You know what? How about you let me know if you come up with something? Maybe there's a um, there's different sayings like instead of like drop like a rock that I've just never heard. I'm going to grab a bunch of sticks while I'm out. We're warming up when we're inside, so we should make the best use of our outside time. Um just to prepare in the future. I'm not going to break down any branches cuz that just takes time. I mean, we're going to warm up inside, so I might as well just Break down a big old branch. Ten minutes. Alright, ten minutes costs us like a quarter of our temperature, it looks like. How about one of the big boys? Oh, I need a hatchet. Right, that would be a goal. To find a hatchet. Oh, have I gotten the toilet water? Did I get the toilet water, guys? Did I get toilet water? Yes, I did. Excellent. Let's have some more toilet water. Mmm. I will never not call it toilet water. Alright. Boop, 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 boop. Dusty pork and beans. Hmm. I will gladly have some dusty pork and beans. I mean, not me personally, because I don't eat meat. I mean, I'm a pescatarian, so I eat fish. Um, and gamey lake whitefish cooked. Hmm. Gamey. I don't like I don't like the term gamey with fish. Oh, there is his face. Moldy peanut butter. Oh boy. Okay. I mean, believe me, I will eat it. Yeah, I think food is not gonna be of our concern during this run, is it? 
We're gonna find plenty of that stuff around. <sighs> hatchet. Where could I find a hatchet? Maybe there's... There are basements in this town, and I should probably... Uh, I've already looked. Um, I should probably have a look at those. Paint. You know what? Let's, uh, let's live like kings. And what is it? Uh, no, don't... Don't drop the rabbit. Don't be silly. Don't start a fight. Nope. I don't want that. Yes, I want that. Let's let's live like kings for a little bit and just light the place. Just to, you know, really make sure we're not missing anything. Wool mittens in bad shape, but we're gonna we'll just collect those while we're at it. Okay. Nothing else. Ooh, yeah, you can't hide from me, Granola Bar. I'm seeing you, crunchy stuff. Cedar firewood, very good. So we don't need to... Wait, sprain risk? Decent down vest, decent fleece mittens. I don't know if those are better than wool mittens. I imagine wool... Mocklocks, boys! Mocklocks. Yes, I never had mocklocks. But I'm pretty happy that we found some. Good old mocklocks. It's a great word to say, mucklock. Mucklock. <laughs> I kind of feel when I say it like that, it sounds like a like a swear word. It's like, oh, you can't say that. My child's listening. Weasel. My favorite when I streamed that one time on YouTube was, I assume this one child, like, stop cussing, my mom is watching. And I assume he didn't want his mom to make him stop watching me or something. It was... Bizarre, to say the least. But yeah, it's weird how we, like, assign these, like, evil meanings to swear words. They don't really, you know, just just because you say the F word, and I'm you know, not saying it because YouTube will punish me severely if I do, um, you know, it doesn't, doesn't ruin your child. Bad parenting does. Not, not hearing words, not forbidding to hear words on the internet. It's like uh, covering when there's like a kiss scene on TV. It's like, oh god, I can't let him see how humans kiss each other. I mean, you, you're gonna be like, ah, that's not real. Of course that's real. Of course that's real. All right. We're very encumbered, 80 pounds, so I will leave the house, I will go back to Quonset gas station, and I will drop some stuff. D -d 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 drop the beat. How could I mark that we've looted this house? I want to put an item down that I don't need anymore. Um, how about something really bad? Like, let's go by condition. That would be it, right? 21. Yeah, I'm just going to drop those wool mittens. Letting us know, like, hey, we've been in here. I just came up with it. It's genius. Oh, I need another thing to drop here in front of the... In front of the door and three... I could also just remember that I didn't... You know what? I'm just going to use my two brain cells that I have. And uh, give them a little bit of a workout and just remember this stuff. That's way smarter. Okay. By the way, thank you, Hinterland, for not putting a frozen dog in a dog hut or something. Because I, I, I don't know if my heart could take it. You know what's really sad? The Moss Rover. Like, his battery's dying and he's all alone by himself. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to bum out anyone. That's just that's just stuff that bums me out. Um, or the fact that it did uh, sing Happy Birthday to itself. On Mars. Alright, so, clothing. Mm, I'm just gonna keep dropping stuff all over the floor. Yeah, let's keep those ragged sweatshirts. Um around kind of leave, leave them next to each other okay so these things let's let's have a do some comparison comparative shopping um look at those boys yeah we're gonna wear those look at all this yeah we're a little slower but who cares um ultimately i don't um throw in a second layer of shoes and yes work pants hey 27 warmth bonus that's pretty awesome Let's try not to get killed. Okay, so repairing this is going to require cloth and cured leather. Good for us, we do have shoes in our inventory. I'm not going to spend too much time doing that yet. Um, as it gets colder, I will have to, you know, improve that. 
Okay, let's drop more clothing that we don't need. The worn ski jacket. Oh, yeah. Um, so this thing is already great. Then we have the decent ski jacket. Decent vest. Yeah, there isn't really anything that's better. Oh, wait a second. Why are you? Why is the dress shirt so much better than this thing? Like, temperature and warm bonus is better than a hoodie. I'm, I, I have my doubts that a dress shirt would be better than a hoodie. But sure, I'll wear a dress shirt. For now. <laughs> what, a, what, a, what a weird combination of items uh, that I'm wearing. It's also really weird to me whenever I play the long dark in the summer. It just doesn't feel quite right. Doesn't feel, doesn't feel right when like outside it's like 100 degrees. Fahrenheit. I feel I should point that out. Okay, we're gonna... Okay, there's our shoes. From those, we're gonna get cured leather to repair our mucklucks. Still think it's a weird word. Uh, on that note, wool mittens or fleece mittens? Definitely the uh, wool mittens. Definitely superior to the fleece mittens. No doubt about that. It's, uh, it's official, boys. Uh, we can go home. So, oh, interesting. How much in pack, how much worn. Didn't even know that there was a little uh, number over here. Okay, so I'm just going to drop the rest on one pile for now. We can sort through that at a later point. Okay, everything is being worn. Food, now that's great. Should we cook the rabbit now? I feel I should put the rabbit outside where it's frozen. Let's put the rabbit out front. Um, I'm not going to eat raw rabbit, obviously. Do, 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 do. Rancid rabbit. Mm, my favorite. Um, but didn't we pick up... Wait. I thought we picked up the uh, the fish. Did we already eat it? I might have already eaten it then. Because I don't see it in my list. Huh. Maybe I have and I just don't recall. Anyway, let's, let's go back inside, drop the food, and then also eat something. I think a good place to go would be the um, overlook. Wow, this is... Man, this looks like my room. Very, very chaotic. Just drop it on the ground. Mom! I'm just... That's just how I... That's how I organize. By just not putting anything in drawers. I just put it on the ground. I'm sure that will totally work as an excuse. Okay, let's enjoy some moldy peanut butter. And most likely get sick from that. Oh, got lucky. Okay, very good. Uh, What else? Yeah, I'm gonna have another pack of chips, maybe? Sure. Tasty. No no need to hunger, because it's just stored calories. Okay, going back to our other food storage, and we're just gonna drop some stuff on here. Just pretty much everything. Except water. Water we're gonna keep, and we're gonna drink. Ooh, herbal tea. Now, that's, that's a good one to have, in case we get uh, sick, injured, you name it. Drop it all. Uh, backpack. We're still pretty full. Uh, why is that? Oh, it's probably because we also have all of those sticks here. Firewood is a good thing to keep because we're most certainly going to need it in the future. Then what else? Oh, the fuel. Yeah, this this happens when I just sort through stuff without editing it down a whole lot. Uh, hmm. Okay. I guess let's go by weight. What? What is so heavy? Right now. I mean, seven pounds for this, three pounds. The clothes are pretty heavy. I will give it that. I'm also still carrying around a um, bedroll. Didn't I have one out here? Yes. So I think we're going to drop the bedroll because we are so close to home base that it doesn't really make sense. Let's drop that firewood. And I guess all of that antiseptic. It's like three pounds as well. Oh, the paint. Nobody nobody needs spray paint here right now. Or a book. Okay, down to 37. I'm just emptying this all out because when we go to the next house, I want to get all the stuff, you know? Man, this will be so annoying if just a wolf comes around the corner and murders me savagely. Just I take a step outside and I'm dead. And I just spent all of this time just sorting stuff out. Okay, so have we been at this house? I don't recall because there's been a few days between me or like two days between me recording episodes. So I'm not entirely sure. Quick look. What are my eyes seeing? My eyes are seeing the Frontier Shooting Guide. That's going to be handy. Handy dandy to learn some of that when we find a gun. 
which I hope full, uh, hopefully will. Okay. Hi. Anyone home? Have I been in here? Something... Nope. Look at the granola bar, ketchup chips. That's a good indicator that you haven't been here. Man, it's just food. It's anything but a food desert. I will be so severely overweight by the end of this run. Is <gasps> coffee. On that note, let me sip some of my own good coffee while we look for these cabinets. Ah, oh, so very good. More antiseptic. What am I supposed to do with all of this? I wish I could start a fire. You know what? Antiseptic. I mean, I guess if it's a hydrogen peroxide, the antiseptic wouldn't do much for fire. But if it was alcohol antiseptic, you could start it as an accelerant. Not ideal, but, you know, disinfectant with alcohol in it burns pretty well. As soon as you're over kind of 50%. I don't know what the magical number is when something becomes flammable, but it's definitely above the 50% mark. I think like 60? I don't know. Somebody in the comment section will most certainly tell me uh, in conjunction with uh, a synonym or an alternative saying for drop like a rock. Ooh, worn thick wool sweater. I like that, you know, for something, you know, clothing that if it's a little bit older and, you know, used that you call it worn but just if you wear something it also i mean it, as soon as it's been used once decent fisherman sweater wow uh as soon as it's been used once it has been worn hasn't it so i feel like worn down uh makes more sense than just worn but that's just 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 me words matter i see i see the candy bar you're not you're not getting away give me all that toilet water half a gallon very good. Anything in the cabinet? Mm, cloth. Water purification tablets. That's gonna also make our lives easier. I rarely use them, but I just should. I just keep hoarding so much stuff in my runs that I never end up using because I die. So, cooking pot. Perfect for making water. Uh, I'm not gonna break down a toaster. That poor toaster has done nothing wrong. And you just want me to break it down like a savage, savage beast. Look at the beautiful day. It is, it is a great day for exploration. It is, it is an excellent day to go and, where is that overlook? It's somewhere over here on the mountains or further over there. I don't recall, but I, I'd like to find it and I'd like to uh, check it out. Okay, let's, let's drop some stuff. Oh, you, you you think I'm just, just going to hang it there? No, we're going to do this together. You want me to play the long dark? I will play the long dark. And we're going to play the damn thing. Okay. <laughs> so many matches. This is insane. Wow. Okay. Um, also, I feel like a box of matches shouldn't weigh a quarter pound. Like, that's that seems unreasonable. Like, I feel like four boxes of wooden matches don't weigh the same as a book. That's just, that's just silly maths, Hinterland. That's just silly, silly thinking. All right, let's bring the other stuff to our food pile. Oh, look at this delicious food pile. I'm so, past me is so jealous of all the food that I found. I feel like I'm cheating, you know? I feel like this, this is not right. I feel like I'm doing something illegal here. By having all of this stuff. Okay, let's uh, drink up. We did find some clothing. I would like to co do some comparative uh, clothes wearing. Um, it was like the heavy sweater thing. Is that in here? Okay, so we have the worn thick wool sweater, which isn't giving us a lot of wind uh, improvement. But look at this boy. Look at this boy. Oh, this is a good boy. Okay, anything that's better than that. I guess it seems that we will have to repair our worn sweater. Takes one hour and some cloth. Tell you what, I'll do it. I'll do it. I like living... <sighs> Failed. Well, I said I would like living on the edge, but I guess not that much. Okay, let's just drop those things off. It's, it's a good sweater. 
I will have to, um, I will wear that. Um, I guess I could also already exchange it. Um, it is a little bit better in terms of wind protection than the other one. And once it's repaired, it's most certainly going to be better than a dress shirt. I, I, I will bet it is. Okay, let's just drop all of the other stuff that we don't need here. <coughs> Lord Almighty, why do I keep sneezing during my videos so much? Any s okay, no other socks. Wow, 29 degrees Fahrenheit warmth bonus. That's excellent. Okay, tell you what. We're going to go out and we're going to look for the Overlook, I think. Or any other interesting landmark. I would also like to find a basement. And there should be basements around. Oh, I'm like really encumbered. Oh, I have the cooking pot with me. Let's just leave that behind. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, you know what to do. You're going to like... Go to that like button, you're gonna have a good, stern look at it, and you're gonna say like, alright, alright, you win this time, I will press you. I will press you, and I will I will like this video, because, you know, why wouldn't you? It's free! Like, you're, you're, just, help, you're just helping me doing that. You know, you're not, you're not letting the capitalist win or anything. It's, it's, it's your moral obligation, or something, something, along those lines. I got nothing. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. I'm Weasel. I'm out now to see you around. Bye-bye. Uh,